Geo 5 is the set of geotechnical programs. The aim of this presentation is to show you how easy you can design your construction with Geo 5 and how fast you could receive the results. We will start with the cantilever wall program. It's typical Geo 5 program. All Geo5 programs looks very similar. You can see the desktop with construction and the vertical toolbar for basic input. At the first, we can start with the name of project, for example, the wall. You can choose units, if you want to use metric or imperial units, you can choose standards for concrete structures. Next, you can input the geometry of the wall. Here you can see the types of walls that you can choose. So, we will start with a, with a normal cantilever wall. You can choose measurement of wall by clicking on the right place. Zoom it. Then we can go to material, choose what type of concrete, what type of reinforcement steel. Another input is geological profile behind the construction. We can add some layers and then we have to introduce soil. Soil should be the parameters of soil should be input from geological survey but Sometimes we don't have it, we have some rare idea what soil, so we can use database implemented in the program with classification, its uh, conservative values of uh, soil. We can start with gravity clay, assign it, then we have to input uh, friction between structure of soil because, of course, uh, it depends on the type of structure. So it cannot be in a database of the soil. We can input another type, for example, self descent. And then we can very easily assign to the profile. So anytime we see how the profile and the whole construction looks like. Another step is terrain behind the construction. We can input horizontal or any other shape what we would like. Next, we can introduce water. Water can be behind the construction, behind and front of construction. It can be behind and front and flow, or we can have some special type of water. For example, if we have artesian water. If you don't know something about the input, or you need some clarification about the way how it is computed. You can press any time F1 for help. You see the topic for water. So, for example, we are interested in influence of water, special distribution, and you have explanation how the artesian water can be input to the program. 
the next we can introduce some surcharge zip for example 13.5 meters lengths to meters magnitude 10 per meter uh, if you want to change change it again you can click the code change it a resistance in front of the wall so we can say it's a pressure at rest or passive or something between it we can add some surcharge on turn and two and of course we have to input some soil we can introduce any type of applied forces for example if you have some anchor or barrier on the top of the wall so you can import everything you can we can implement earthquake too inquiry set very important thing is settings you can use settings in different countries they are set but you can in introduce your user defined settings so all let's say analysis can be done by with safety factor or limit states or you can use standard setting with 1.5 safety factor so we start with a verification you see the all forces that act on the construction so we see the slip is not okay so we can make some changes in geometry for example we can make longer 